Okay, hey collector. So this is gonna be a collective reading. Okay, spirit, what messages do you have here for the collective? What messages do you have here? Um I'm not gonna make this very long because I keep getting this energy uh in these readings, but there is somebody that's want to make a move towards another person. But this individual does not want... Like, the person this individual wants to make a move towards does not want to be with them. It just is what it is. Like, this person... Maybe somebody had a bad experience in a relationship with another person. And the individual that they were in a relationship with in the past has not let go of their energy. Like, this person is trying to figure out how to make a move towards this individual. Like, this person could be like... Somebody... This is like, this is annoying. This is somebody that treated somebody horribly in a relationship. So this individual feels like they needed to go away to heal. And now this person is wanting to make a move back towards the individual that they treated horribly in a relationship. This person does not want to be with this individual from their past. I'm telling you, like somebody treated another person horribly in a relationship and these two could have stopped dealing with each other. And now this person is wanting to try to come back around like, like somebody is not moving on. That's what it like. Somebody is refusing to let another person just live their life and be happy. Like whoever this queen of swords energy is, she does not want to be with somebody from her past. This person could be accusing her of being mean and all of this other mess. No, she does not want to be with you. That's what this is. This Queen of Swords energy has horrible memories about a relationship. Why would you want to go back into a cycle with somebody that you have horrible memories with? <laughs> I'm telling you. So now like this Queen of Swords, somebody is like... I got this energy in a previous reading, which I um I posted unlisted. Yeah, so I'm not going to make this long. What's going on here? Yeah, uh, whoever this Queen of Swords energy is, she gets a lot of attention for something that she does for work as well. That could be why somebody from her past is trying to come back around to her as well. Yep. Um, okay, this, this is, this is prime example of what I'm talking about. Okay, whenever this Queen of Swords energy, whenever her business is doing, like, whenever her business slows down, somebody from her past feels like they feel more, um, confident to make a move towards her. What kind of person behaves like that? Like, are you that insecure? Like, no, she does not. Whoever this Queen of Swords energy is, she does not want to connect with like whoever this person is. I mean, this is this is really disturbing. This is an insecure ass person that's like trying to go away and act like he has done the healing work. He, she, a pot of roses they fit, only to come back around. But this person only wants to reach out to this Queen of Swords energy when her business is slowing down, and he could be behind her business slowing down. Maybe he's insecure. I'm really getting this could be a masculine energy that this feminine energy is dealing with or was dealing with in the past. It's like he's intimidated by this queen of swords whenever she's winning. Yeah. Uh, he doesn't want other people seeing her as well. Or something like that. Like she's held in high honor and maybe she could be in the, uh, like a, the spotlight or something like that. He doesn't want other people seeing her. That's what I'm getting here. So when her business slows down, he feels more confident to make a move towards her because he's insecure as hell. What's going on here? Yep, childish. I knew it. Childish, immature, insecure. And watching this queen of swords who he feels like is a mean person. No, you're insecure and she does not want anything to do with you. She's not mean. Like, what kind of person would be intimidated by another person just living their life and doing what makes them happy? That's what I'm getting like. Whatever this Queen of Swords energy is doing, she's minding her business. 
That's what I'm getting. What's going on here? Okay, somebody somebody is wanting to, like, I'm really getting whoever this individual is. He's like, I don't know why I'm getting, like, he's trying to hide or creep. Or maybe he's just obsessed with this Queen of Swords energy. And, like, this Queen of Swords is coming across as somebody that's, like, she's cutting with her words. And the reason she's cutting with her words is because she has an immature, like, whoever this individual is. He wants to make some type of like rush move towards her, but he has not even done the healing work. And even regardless, like this man, he does man, look here. This is, this is, it's unattractive. I'm just going to, this is ridiculous. What's going, anything else? And then I'm ending this. I'm not giving this much. Yep. See, he wants her to be nice to him he wants he wants that old thing back he wants the the person he was with when she was patient with him and loving and compassionate well he screwed her over one too many times he wanted her to baby him and like no he wanted her to coddle his ego no so now he feels like she's mean because she won't baby him and coddle his ego and like whatever to see is like no sir like i don't know why i'm getting this man once that man this is so <sighs> um this is a masculine energy that's trying to like play like he's a divine masculine but he's not he's an insecure like no he's he's not a divine masculine he's an insecure karmic masculine and he did this Queen of Swords energy wrong. And he's accusing her of being mean. That's what I'm getting. Yeah, she's holding back. She's not like, no, she's not. She's not playing this man's game. That's what I'm getting. She's not playing this man's game. She's not about to um, stroke his ego. She's not about to enable him. None of that. Like, she's not playing those games. She does not want nothing to do with this man. That's She doesn't want nothing to do with this man. I mean, it is what it, you cannot make it up. She does not want nothing to do with this man. She's done with this man. He's watching her. He's obsessively watching her and feeling like a victim. This is this is ridiculous. Like, let people move on with their life. You didn't treat somebody right, but you won't let this person move on with their life and go out and meet somebody new. Don't nobody want to be in a relationship with somebody that's like insecure as hell. Like, don't nobody got time for that. Like, you don't even know who you are. I'm telling you. Like, whoever this Queen of Swords energy is, she felt in prison in this relationship with somebody that's insecure. So, he feels like he has to try to control her. Tear her down. Tear down her confidence because he's insecure as hell. I'm ending this reading. I'm ending this reading. Like, she does not want nothing to do with this man. And it's annoying that he keeps, like, he's... This man could have even been doing spell work on her. He, man, this is the shit I'm talking about. Yeah, wow. He's doing spell work on her because he wants her to choose him. No, sir, you lost your opportunity with this feminine energy. Let it go and move on. Trying to do spell work. All that spell work, you're, all that spell work is doing is making you more obsessed with this feminine energy. It ain't doing nothing to her because she's still moving on with her life. She does not want nothing to do with this individual here. Doing spell work. Yeah, I'm, look. <laughs> you cannot make this up. This man is doing spell work on this feminine energy because he wants communication from this feminine energy. So she's in no communication with him. She's in no communication with him. She could have blocked him on all platforms. She blocked his number. She blocked all text now numbers he tries to call from. She does not want nothing to do with this man. And this man seems to not understand that. I'm ending this. He did something to her money here as well. Or he's mad that she has her own or something like that. Yeah. Yeah. Things are going to work out for this feminine energy, um, especially if this man did spell work on her money.
That's what he did. He did spell work. Wow. Okay. I see exactly what's going on here. He didn't spell work on this feminine energy because on her money. Because he wanted her to be broke. And he thought that if he did spell work on her money and slow her money down. That is why he gets excited and feels more confident when he sees her business slowing down. Because he did spell work on her money. Because he thinks that if she's broke and struggling, she would want to be with him or she would need him. How insecure. This is a beta male. This is an insecure. Like, this, this is... This is unattractive. This is very unattractive. This is, I'm, that's, I'm in this. That's disgusting. This literally disgusts me. Uh, no, his plan is not going to work. She's moving on towards somebody new. That's what I'm getting towards new opportunities as well. She's not dealing with this man, but he did spell work on her money because he thought that if she was broke and struggling, then he, like she would want to be with him. So whenever he sees her business slowing down, he gets excited and thinks that, yeah, no, sir. No, sir. She's not dealing with you. I'm ending this reading.